Really? Really? <laughs> Are you sure? Is it going? Is now? it going? Oh my god. What? Oh no. Oh, hi. Okay. Hi. We're nutrific. Yeah, and so am I. There you go. And um, we're here to talk about uh, what we're doing. What we're we're finally back together again. I know, isn't this so cool? Look, isn't yeah. she fabulous? Look at that. Look at that. Look at that smile. Okay. So I'm still working on the Tom Tin jacket. And you started your second color. I started, started my second color. Yeah. And so I I don't have any toddlers around. So I don't know how long to make this. It's really dark. So I think I'm gonna do I think I'm just gonna do right up there before I work on the sleeves. So. A little bit longer. A little bit longer. A little bit longer. It's the body. Rise between um, the waist and, and it's peacefully. So, so it's very pretty. Yeah, I like it. Yeah. And, um, so what so color is it? What am I working on? Yeah, what do you? What do you? Working I was looking at. I was thinking. I'm looking. I'm wearing a sweater that I. Yeah, I was wondering if you actually. Yeah. Yeah. It's beautiful. Yeah. Why did Thank you do you. that? Um, this is about five years ago, and I actually knit this all from stash yarn. I did not buy any yarn for it. And this is, yeah, this is um, uh, the Donegal Tweed. And we have some, this green is one of the, oh gosh, the Lopi from a different one. And this was somewhere in stash and it all worked. Some other thing. Yeah, some stash. other thing. It's gorgeous. Yeah, it's a really beautiful Thanks. pattern. So what are you knitting? Um, I am knitting, I'm still working on this. I'm Toppy, Toppy, Toppy. I call it Toppy. Toppy. That looks kind of big. And it is kind of big, but um, the person I'm knitting for has a big head. Um, physically, not figuratively. Mm. Although sometimes <laughs> figuratively too. Mm. No, 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 no. This head. Oh, <laughs> no, no, that's not what she said. Might be. Yeah. Does this person way know? Too, but I don't know about that. Okay. I, I don't, don't want to know. know. It's sort of, I don't want to know. It's, okay, moving on. I'm this is a children's I'm so flustered program. now. <laughs> So, um, anyway, I'm making this hat, and I'm almost done. See, I've got the brim, and I just have a couple more rows until that matches up, and then I'll put a piece of plastic in there, and then it'll be a nice cap. Cute. Very nice. Like that. And then I'm also, I've, um, I've dipped into the dark side, and I am now a hooker, meaning I'm doing some crochet. And this is the Queen Anne's lace that I vlogged about the other day. Yeah, it's a beautiful pattern. It's going really quickly. And um, I love the way that it's patterning with the self striping yarn. And um, I still have quite a bit of yarn on the skein, so I'm not quite sure what I'll do with it. If I'll, I'll, I'll make it nice and long for one thing. Are you going to finish that whole? I don't know. That's what I'm considering, whether or not I'll finish the whole skein of yarn or stop before. And that's a Regia? It's Regia. Um, or fly color. Oh, actually, I actually have it. Oh, yeah, but crochet is kind of cool that way because it doesn't really matter. You can figure out where you are. And then I'm wearing um, a tie dye shirt because it's in um, commemoration of my friend David Bailey. David who Bailey? Died on, David, on October 2nd of brain cancer. And what's cool about this story is that he was diagnosed with brain cancer. Years ago, and he was only supposed to live like six months, and so he totally beat the odds. Excellent. Oh, and wow. when he was given such a short time to live, he um, quit his corporate job and decided to make the most of his left time remaining and became a musician, which was his first love. And what what, what he instrument did he play? He played guitar, okay. and he wrote and sang his own music, mostly about hope inspiration and holding on to survival and hope and making the most of each day. And he performed all over the world, a lot of times at like cancer rallies and um, cancer hospitals. I know he's performed at the James, which is how we got talking about this because David works at the James. Say hi, David. Hi. And um, so I know that other people all over the world are, have heard of him and know who he is. And, and you can find information about him. I'll link it, but it's www.davidmbailey.com. David M. Bailey? Mm -hmm. And But I'll put the link in once we get it yeah. posted. Wow. And um, he's done like 20 albums or 23 albums or something like that. That's incredible. His music's really beautiful. He's a very gifted guitarist and um, just a lot of hope and inspiration to be found. So if you know someone who is going through really hard times and can use some faith, um, it's good stuff to share. So, so that's why I'm wearing this, because his daughter asked for people to go into the funeral to wear tie-dye, even though the funeral's all the way in um, North 
Carolina, people on Facebook, friends of his, have all committed to wearing tie dye today to remember him. Because he was a real tie dye sort of a kind of a homeless guy. Oh. So, like, like me. Like you. <laughs> You're not a guy though. Yeah. You're all woman. Yes. I'm every woman. <laughs> She is woman, hear her roar. That too. I don't want to hear her roar. That would scare me. <laughs> <laughs> so, anyway. So, do you have a favorite memory of him? Um, I just, I remember just being in classes with him in college. And he's very intelligent. And he had um, a very interesting life before college. His father was the head of the American School of Theology in Beirut, and wow. so he grew up in Beirut, and wow. actually was kidnapped at one point for like a few days. Well, he and led a very crazy, vivid life. Crazy life, yeah. But he was just very, um, you know, introspective and poetic kind of a guy, and you know. And you mentioned that he was on 60 Minutes. Yeah, he's been on 60 Minutes, and he was on 48 Hours, you know, because he so he conquered the odds of brain cancer. I mean, he was really sort of a celebrity just because of that. Six months to 14, 14 years. years. I know, right? And I bet those 14 years were maxed out, man. Yeah. Lived to the fullest. I mean, yeah, he, I followed his um, emails and his blog for the last couple of years, and he'd be like... Yeah, you know, I'm kind of tired from chemo, but I'm gonna, I've got a great show I'm going to do tonight. Wow. You know, yeah. you play the packed houses. And... Yeah, that's perfect. Yeah. yeah. Wow. Yeah. That's a pretty, pretty terrific thing, actually. Yeah, it is a terrific thing. That's your terrific thing. Yeah. Yeah, David. There you go. So what's his, um, his website again? DavidMBailey.com. It's B-A-E-A-I-L-E-Y. Okay. Go look it up. Find out who, who we're missing about. Yeah, he's cool. Right. Okay. Thanks for sharing that. Sure. So, I made her do that. But yeah, he did. Yeah, yeah. she. She was telling he is. Yeah, he's I'm pushy. Bossy. Yeah. Pushy. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Take care. Bye. Bye.